Kettlebell carries are a great way to strengthen your grip, your upper back and shoulders, and a sneaky way to get in some core work. I often program carries into my online kettlebell clients workouts because I know that they're effective. And I want to show you four different carries that you can incorporate into your workouts to get a lot stronger. Hi, I'm Ryan Jenkwitz. I'm the owner of RJ Kettlebell. And I use my online kettlebell programs to help men and women lose weight, shed their spare tire, and build lean muscle so they can fit better in their clothes and look better naked. So the first carry is the suitcase carry. And this is when we hold the kettlebell on the side of the body. So you often do a suitcase deadlift to get the bell up. Now while doing this, we want to make sure that we're active. Passive would be letting the arm just hang. And the kettlebell is resting on the leg. So what I want to do is pull my shoulder back and slightly bring the kettlebell off my body from here. I would just walk around for time or distance. And I feel my left arm working hard, upper back and shoulder, and the obliques on this left side here. The next carry that you can do is a rack carry. So you do one clean, bring the kettlebell into the rack position, and carry again for time or distance. This places a lot of emphasis on the shoulder, lat, and abs. So do a good clean. Pull the shoulder down so there's no tension in your ear. Get nice and tight through the midsection and walk. The next carry is an overhead carry. So you press the kettlebell over your head. Make sure the shoulder is pulled down into the side. We don't want to shrug the shoulder up to the ear. That can stress the neck and traps. So you just hold the kettlebell overhead and walk for time or distance. Good way to strengthen your overhead movements as well. And last we have bottoms up carry. You're going to want to go a little bit lighter because it is much more challenging and it really taxes the grip. So again, the shoulders pulled down, nice tight grip on the kettlebell, abs engaged, and then you just walk around for time or distance. So those are four different carries you can incorporate into your kettlebell workouts to get a lot stronger. If you have any more questions about kettlebell training, please send me a message. Stay strong.